today we are going to be talking about the menaces, the characters that didn't just break Dragon Ball Legends, but they almost ruined the entire game. Whether you're getting one-shotted in PvP, stuck in an endless combo, or watching the timer run out because you just couldn't land a hit, these characters made it painful to even queue up. So let's dive in, starting with, yes, Zenkai Android 18. There's a mercy to fools like you. You guys have seen the clips. This unit destroyed any Saiyan in the game. Any character. Doesn't matter what element, you could be a red. She gets her strike, you switch out, car draw speed, her strikes do more damage, her combos didn't stop, and they were probably the most powerful combos in the game, apart from LF, Zenkai, Red, Gohan. You didn't, you, the game was done. If you saw her, the game was done. If you did not Rising Rush her, your game was done. And she didn't even need a Rising Rush to delete your whole team. She was the literal definition of unbalanced and for a while people were calling for Zenkai to be removed from the game and they would stop playing the game if it doesn't get changed just from one character. Whew. Moving on. Next unit may be a Zenkai that you probably have never seen before in PvP but it's Green Majin Buu. He can get you in, locked and stuck and more importantly he had amazing health and pretty much infinite healing when you swap into him your opponent cannot switch and i think it was around 15 time accounts so most of the time people are combining him with lf vegeto blue you start with margin boo you bring in vegeto blue and your opponent is pretty much locked in if they have a red unit it's gg like your first unit is gone he wasn't really much of a fighter, but he did deal good damage. And his blue card is one of those ones that you have to be in close proximity, but can deal a lot of damage. He was one of the first big tanks in the game alongside Android 16, who also had the Zenkai around the same time. But if you were a blue player, all you had to do was stall and heal, stall and heal. These games would drag on for the whole three minutes of game time. On to maybe the most broken unit of them all. I was going to give this girl on a separate video and I still might go ahead. The one unit, if I had to put on this entire video, entire list that actually nearly ruined the game was Zenkai LF Super Saiyan 2 Gohan. Legends decided to give him a Zenkai. They gave him damage, they gave him buffs, they gave him hybrid Saiyans. At the time, I think they were giving two other Son family units or two other hybrid Saiyans, um, Zenkai's as well, which made this Gohan even better. He was literally the solo unit. If you challenged him without maybe a full blue counter team, the, the game was done. This Gohan, the damage, the combos, the ultimate, he would not only would he get a rising rush quick because of his combos his damage itself he did not care about type disadvantage he really didn't kind of like android 18 these two maybe at my whole time playing the game were the two biggest damage dealers once again these gohans this gohan was making people quit the game they were saying no remove zenkai zenkai are too far i think at that time i was even like these zenkais are way better than lfs and LFs are harder to get. Zenkai's, if you have them seven stars, here we go. The Zenkai LF go on nothing. I don't think has come close to him yet. We've had a few UVBs, LF Vegito Blue. This Gogeta that we have now is really, really good as well. But this Gohan might be the best unit ever in the game. I think even after a year after he came out, he was still amazing soloing teams. 
it's only recently maybe in the past year that he's not been used so much anymore but this Gohan maybe if you're a lower rank player trust me use him on your team this guy wipes teams he solos every team next up Super Saiyan 2 Kefla another combo heavy damage heavy unit I remember she was in her prime with the red go tanks I think right before the second anniversary green unit as well combo combo key combo key combo key combo key it seems like every unit that's been good in the game all you need is a long enough combo and key if you didn't have a way to interrupt her combos you sat there watching your health bar evaporate while she just flexed her green card over and over again gaining key and maybe health i can't remember this was truly one of the most annoying units to deal with if you were using her fantastic if you were going against her really annoying long combo again another unit that didn't really care too much about type disadvantage she was a green didn't care about the purples especially when Fuzamasu came out like a month later I was still using her against Fuzamasu but yeah this Kefla amazing second anniversary Vegito Blue this guy people summoned for this Vegito Blue I had so many friends that don't usually play Dragon Ball Legends that installed the game just for this Vegito Blue I said that Gohan's number one this Vegito is not far at all. His counters untouchable. His ultimate. His ultimate. What's ultimate again? Mm -mm, it's okay not to be as good as me. The endless strike combos. I remember it. You go again and again and again. The combos. The combos again. The combos and the key. And the ultimate and the blue card. I'm pretty sure the blue card had a lock in after you hit it as well. This was the unit where you started to see a lot of players getting second rising rushes because you combo, 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 combo. Guess what? Use the rising rush, combo, 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 get one again. It doesn't matter who this Vegeta was up against, you were finished. And I'm going to use this one to build onto my next one, which is similar to this LF full power Broly. Again, the combos, but this Broly type disadvantage, I mean, L type advantage or neutrality on the ultimate the combos kept going if you switch out he give you card draw speed the ultimate the ultimate was so powerful he free you out and forced you to swap his blue card had a chance of faint green card key card draw speed this Broly again kind of similar to Vegeta Blue in some aspects but just he, he was just so powerful if you didn't put a perfect team to counter him, the game was over. This character made PvP feel like a boss fight. Purple UI sign Goku. The first unit in the game with a dodge animation. I remember my first TikTok I ever uploaded was gameplay of this purple UI Goku. When he first dropped, maybe the hypest unit of all time, I was in I could not log into my phone. I was in the classroom trying to summon. It was taking an hour to load up one. Dodge. After dodge. After dodge. Vanishing left and right without touching your phone. People were just, people were just sitting there and waiting for his unique gauge to run out so they could actually play the game. PvP turned into a waiting room for this purple US and Goku. His green card would blow you back and this ultimate might be my most landed ultimate in the game maybe LF Gito Blue for the second anniversary but this Goku the amount of damage his ultimate did and his blue card gave him a more unique gauge his green card too definitely one of the best units that nearly ruined the game another mention I wanted to include was Tag Android 17 and 18 I don't remember this portion i didn't have this unit so i was going against them and they were a big problem i mean whatever color you throw at them you could just go from 17 to 18. it was like playing chess against them they had every all the pieces the synergy was off the charts 
you could be oppressive defensive with them at the time android needed units i remember so this character just took the team i remember this team was like i think on the game press website was like top one or two at the time it was incredible but yeah android 17 and 18 tag amazing blue beast go on this guy didn't just enter the game he owned the game his ult oh my gosh his blue card one shot this may be the most one shots i've ever seen from a unit ever ever like any unit on this list the amount of blue card one shots this beast gohan had was incredible like the ult damage the combo potential the buffs this beast gohan turned pvp into a game of survival like this beast gohan if you didn't have him in the game you were at a big disadvantage i remember at the time I was loading into every game. I think the videos might be still up on my channel. I was loading up saying, please don't let me face a blue beast Gohan comboed with a red pan. who will take my key. I can't, I couldn't. Such a hard team to compete against. I was using purple Piccolo, trying to just get through, get through the time beast going home was dominating. One of the best units ever released in the game. Let me know in the comments who you think was the unit the best unit on this list and any units I forgot to mention or should have been included in this video, let me know in the comments. Thank you for watching.